Alan and I teach a sort of master class um, for the dark students. That's the media group, the, the, the MFA students. And the dean, Jaeger, one day of the whole division, made a mad statement. He said, whoever wants to form a center and you can prove it's a good idea and maybe even get a money, I'll approve it. So we said, well, how about an institute? Sounds better than a center. He said, institutes are bureaucratically impossible, um, but a center I can make. So Helen and I made a proposal that we make a center for the study of the force majeure, that which I just described. It was approved. We got grants. And we're learning. So, we see it as a way of accruing funds, research, information, and finally outreach for both students and scientists and artists to deal with not global warming where everybody does little patches of this, that, and the other, but to deal with whole systems at great scale. The work of the center of the force majeure is um, in three parts. One is original research. You can see that at Sage Hand. Um, but the other is um, putting together artists and scientists. And we're talking social scientists as well as, say, biologists. Um, maybe even a physicist, if we can get deep enough into entropy. Um, so that when one says put them together, we don't mean that in a, a trivial sense. We mean that we gather together to help resolve problems of great magnitude, i.e., what do you do about a heat wave running across the planet at the scale that it exists? And that is our work.